Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another weekly vlog. It is currently Thursday. It's like four o'clock. And as usual, I'm spending the last hour on the treadmill. I actually have it set up to where I have it under my regular desk because it is a sit stand desk instead of usually being over here at the stand desk only. Anyways, so I'm standing here and I'm about to finish my work day and I just wanted to come on and update you guys because this weekend it's gonna be a little hectic. Um, tonight we're actually going over to Ryan's parents' house to spend the night with them because tomorrow night Ryan has his 10 year high school reunion. So it's gonna be like at the high school homecoming football game. Um, so I'm gonna go with him. It starts at like around five-ish, so I would we would not be able to go. It's like two hours away. Um, we would not be able to go after work tomorrow. So we're just gonna go to his parents' house, so we're already there, and that'll work out pretty well. So I'm gonna be working from their house tomorrow, and then on Saturday, we have a baby shower also in the same area, so we're just gonna stay the night and um, go to the baby shower. And then on Sunday, we have our race. So I'm doing the 5K and Ryan's doing the 10K and that should be a lot of fun. So it's a busy weekend for us. Um, yeah, but I'm excited. And I wanted to update you guys because I have been trying to up my step goal. So I used to aim for 10K steps a day and I noticed whenever I got this walking pad is really when I started doing the 10K steps which was last year around, I wanna say it was in the spring before it got too hot, but, or maybe I got it in the summer, I don't remember. But either way, this was maybe like 250 or $300. It's lasted me a year, it's pretty good. Um, but I noticed a big difference when I started hitting 10K steps a day, like being able to stay a certain weight. Um, so it's been really helpful for me. So I've been trying to up it to 15K just for like a challenge for myself because I felt like 10K was just not enough, I don't know. So I'm at like 6,000 steps right now. I'm gonna get on the treadmill and then I also have a run after work. So I'll be at 15 for the day and this is like week two of doing that and it's kind of nice. Like it's challenging me to stay up and stay like, you know, alert and awake during work, which is great. So I'm not like getting bored or anything. So yeah. Um, that's the update for now. I'm gonna let you guys go, finish my work day, and I will talk to you guys later. got back from the dentist I had a cleaning and I always pick up Starbucks for myself after I go to the dentist so I picked up a grande apple crisp oat milk macchiato and this is my first time trying it it's pretty good but I can't get like a feel for exactly what it tastes like I don't know it's not my favorite thing ever but it's got like a hint of apple people say it tastes like candles I don't think it tastes like candles but I don't think I would get this over other things <laughs> So earlier this weekend, I actually got the um, cinnamon dulce latte and it was iced and it was so delicious. 
So that one was really good. Um, I would probably get that one over this, but I was really feeling like a hot coffee. And I picked up some egg bites, so I'm gonna eat those. And then <laughs> Kai and I are gonna get to work, but I did wanna close off the vlog here. Crazy weekend, we did a lot of stuff. I didn't really vlog a ton because I don't know, I, I, I didn't feel right to like vlog while we were at Ryan's 10 year high school reunion. I didn't know these people. I'm not gonna vlog during that. Um, and then to vlog a friend's baby shower is like kind of weird. So yeah, but it was a great weekend. We spent it with a lot of family and friends and had a lot of fun. Um, I will say Friday night, I got some ant bites on my ankles, so I'm not walking too hot right now. Um, it's kind of swollen, so that's not fun. But um, the 5K still went really well, even though it was a little swollen. The 5K was so much fun. I forgot to say, you guys, we finished on Rice Stadium and that was the biggest like energy booster ever. They had a lot of volunteers and I think they were all like Rice University students cheering you on. And so you run down the tunnel, like you're the football team coming out for the game and they're just cheering you on so hard. It's so fun. So I just like turn on the gas and sprint into the finish to the 50 yard line. And it was so cool. So that was awesome. <laughs> really enjoyed that 5K. Um, I did really good. I think I got my personal best and I didn't stop once to walk and breathe and stuff. So that's a new thing for me. So I did really good. We're gonna plan on doing, I think, a turkey trot in November, um, the day of Thanksgiving. So we're gonna plan on doing another run, but that was really fun. I forgot to tell you guys about that. So yeah, anyways, busy, busy, busy weekend. Next weekend will be a lot more chill and hopefully we will have some more fall shopping because I really wanna go see more fall things. I wanna go to Bath Muddy because I haven't been in like over a month. And I really want to go to like TJ Maxx or Marshalls and check out their body care. So yeah, uh, but that'll be for next week. So anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching this week's vlog. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.